Have you ever conducted any funny or terrible interviews? Like what happened? Is there a cool story there? Yeah. So in terms of interviews, I um, haven't come across super funny ones, but I always, I always take away the, the most memorable ones are always someone that can build rapport really easily with the team. So the hiring managers might um, see a really impressive candidate and if they can um, ease into the conversation really well, that's really nice because it kind of just makes everyone a little bit more calmer and you can bring some good, you know, if you can bring some good conversation to the interview, it then doesn't become an interview anymore. It becomes more of a conversation and the hiring managers love that because they can kind of start to see how you're going to fit into their, their, their team and how you're going to interact with other members. So yeah, I always think those, those are the most memorable ones. Um, we did have a really funny one um, during COVID times, which I'm sure everyone has had. Um, they were all virtual. So we always tell students, you know, you're only going to be virtual, but you should still dress professionally and you should still wear business attire as, as you can because it shows um, that you're still conducting this in a professional environment. Um, and a lot of people do um, come dressed professionally. Um, and we had someone that top was very professional, bottoms were, I think, a pair of board shorts in the heat of summer. So that was really funny when he went for his, his um, break in between the interview and the group activity and he stood up and everyone saw his beach board shorts. <laughs> and that was really funny. So he played it off well, but um, it just reminded everyone. He was a bit embarrassed at the end, but it turned out fine. Um, but just a note, like if you're doing something virtual, like make sure that, you know, you are appropriately dressed all the way um, because you never know when you have to stand up <laughs> or move your computer or something. So that's a funny one that I had probably a couple of years ago in the peak of COVID when we were all kind of getting used to virtual only.